Hi guys and welcome back to the channel, Ron's Keto Cafe and I'm Ron. If you're new, welcome. If you're a returning member, welcome back. If you're a new member, could you please share, like, and subscribe to my channel. Well, this slideshow that I made a while back goes about my uh, first 100 pounds of weight loss that I lost since I started the ketogenic uh, lifestyle on uh, August 17, 2020. You can clearly see all the uh, difference in the photographs from this photograph on the left is at the Doyle State in the about maybe a year later that year of 2021. I was exactly 100 pounds on the, that I had lost and to this day I'm still over 100 pounds of uh, weight loss uh, three years later and I uh, just thoroughly enjoy doing uh, videos and recipes. Uh, this is my Aunt Jeanette on my left photograph of my mom's funeral and I uh, the one on the right, she was teaching me some photography, and my friend Kelly, uh, we were at the uh, gym during the early days of 2020, and uh, yeah, and, uh, continuing on to the uh, next slide over here, this is the uh, Pulpit's Rock at Shoal Farms, uh, hike that Mary and I had done up there, and uh, clearly see the difference in my weight. This particular photograph you're seeing is the uh, um, I would choose it up in Princeton there and I was you see clearly how I was struggling to get up that mountain over there on the side and this is my favorite hiking place over there at Barrett Park I go there quite often I had somebody take a photograph of me both days and um, again over here on the left at the Doyle Estate the Society and in 2019 I won the Citizen of the Year my posed a photograph of my wife and that's my friend Mary over there on my right. Her and I do a lot of walking adventures together and uh, you know if I, if I find any little uh, trinkets like that that's interesting I'll take a uh, photograph. That's my friend Carlos here, he's an officer in the city of Lemister. He had weight loss surgery at the same time I had uh, my weight uh, loss uh, reduction on my weight loss journey and this is uh, my dream goal going skydiving. And my sister's birthday on the 60th birthday back a few years ago when I first started keto, you could clearly see the difference in the weight. Childhood memories on that uh, Lemister shirt with the big L. I was uh, climbing up the stairs. And again, I'm just doing a comparison with the both photographs. And uh, of course, the Sheldon Farms, uh, this is uh, three different years of uh, different photographs that I took. And uh, you could clearly see the amount of weight that I lost. The photograph on the left on uh, 2009 or 10, I believe, I was that was probably the biggest I've ever weighed, 410 pounds, and this is me pretending to climb the rock and shoulder bombs. I got halfway up the rock there and put my hip gave out of me before we realized it was my hip, and, I, uh, and of course everybody knows that I volunteer for the local studio, and uh, we have a lot of photographs with me in the studio, and uh, together we're filming local activities, and uh, every year, the uh, mayor puts up a huge eagle at the local common area. In that particular year, I was taking different photographs and just walking around. And of course, I was starting to drop up hanifers. And this is from one of the winter stroll events that I was walking around, and you could clearly see a difference in my weight. And again, over here, we did the uh, every February second, we have a. Uh, uh, Pink Flamingo thing, uh, Groundhog Day. This is how we celebrate it. And that's my friend Kim on the right. And representing Lemister with Natalie Higgins. We were doing a show and uh, talking about a history show. And on the left, I was doing photography at one of the local events. Uh, again, with the local event on the left, and this is my friend Dean Mazzarella, the mayor of Lemister. This you can see, clearly see how big I was in that photograph. And this is why I have people take photographs of me when I'm out walking and doing adventures. Again, with my wife and my friend Maz at uh, the uh, society, clearly see my big stomach sticking out. The photograph on the left was my wife and myself at a, 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 a baby shower, and the one on the right is just a comparison, and again, another comparison in the early days of 220 with the same event, we had the Festival of Trees in our city. So these are all some of my walking adventures, and I just I wanted to get, I was pretending to be Rocky, going up the stairs over here at the uh, place where I volunteer. No problems anymore. I don't use the cane anymore. Sometimes I'm just, you know, as I'm just walking around taking goofy selfie, selfie photographs because I just enjoy taking photography. That's my friend John. Uh, you can clearly see the difference in my photograph. This was taken in early 2020, and on the right, that was uh, during the course of my one year doing the weight loss. And again, with the mayor over here on my left, I would track the parade in 2019, and you can clearly see the difference in uh, that particular photograph. It, 
again, these are all photographs and activities I did the first year when I was on weight loss and I, I, as I continue to uh, get my weight off and continue to get healthy. I hope you've been enjoying the recipes and the awesome videos that I've been putting up and they're really going to keep getting better from here and, and of course, you know, I'm still going to school. I haven't re uh, totally given up. Uh, and, uh, you know, we did get a new car, so I'll be able to, you know, go back to school now and everything will be kosher again. And uh, I hope I continue to put out some of uh, these great recipes for you. And then, you know, we're going to start doing some lives, and I kind of like it. Uh, this photograph on the left, I was being silly doing egg fasting. I had so many eggs that week, I felt like I was getting ready to turn into a chicken. And uh, one of my friends sent me this amazing uh, bat, little bat pen here because yeah, every morning I wish somebody quotes and good morning quotes and you know my amazing quotes and of course my favorite quote you only build when you stop trying it you are amazing and thank you for watching this video and if you watch it for all these amazing videos and don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel thank you and have a great day guys.